What is going on guys? Welcome to Gregel's TV Daily or Source for Daily Tech News. Make sure you subscribe so you know what's going on in the world of tech. How is everyone doing? Let's get into the news. The first story of the day is about the Huawei Mate X foldable phone which will be announced at MWC which is just around the corner now and they have a leaked photo from a promo poster showing off this phone. And from what we can see right here, it folds in half and then when it opens up, it's just basically like a giant display of a tablet here. So this, again, this will be announced at Mobile World Congress, which is this week. And we don't know any prices or anything, so it might be 2,000, it might be 1,000, maybe it'd be somewhere in the middle, but regardless, it looks like a very interesting phone. The other day we were talking about the customization of the Bixby button where uh, you'll be able to change that button to basically almost anything else you want. Maybe open up Spotify, open up Google Photos, open your phone, whatever you want it to do rather than opening up Bixby, you're gonna be able to do that on the Galaxy S10 line of phones. Well, you're also gonna be able to do it on any phone that's running Android Pie. So S8, S9, uh, S9 Plus, you know, Note 9, Note 8, all those phones will also get the same customization, which is wonderful news. I never use this button. Um, so giving me the ability to give it functionality to do something else, big thumbs up in my book. Next up, if you're interested in the new Galaxy Watch Active, which is Samsung's newest fitness watch, and it's 199 bucks. And also what you get with it is you get uh, the ability to track your heart rate. It can detect irregular heartbeats, monitors your sleep, blood pressure. Uh, it's swim ready, can last up to two days on a single charge, uh, recognizes 39 different activities, has a 1.1 inch AMOLED display, dual core processor, uh, 20 millimeter bands, four gigs of storage, 768 megabytes of RAM, Bluetooth 4.2, NFC for mobile payments. Well, you can also get, if you're pre-order right now, you also get their free fast wireless charging pad, which ends up being a $60 value. So obviously this watch can charge wirelessly. Um, you can do this on that new free wireless charging pad. I'll link it down below. And the last story of the day is obviously the Galaxy S10 line of phones has a camera in the top right with the camera like literally on the display and maybe you wanna hide that and maybe you're concerned you might not be able to hide it and you're gonna look at it all the time because it might bother you. Well, there's software inside of the phone that allows you to hide it. SamMobile.com has a link up, which I will put in the description down below, uh, like I do with all my stories, showing you how to disable that camera on the display. It basically puts a black bar at the top. It's gonna make your screen smaller, so if you want the biggest screen ever, you might not want to enable it, but it will hide that camera for you, so it kind of looks like it has a bezel at the top. I don't think me and myself will be doing this. I'll be fine just using the phone as is, whatever, no big deal. But let me know about you. Would you turn this feature on your Galaxy S10 phone or not? Again, let me know in the comments down below. Thanks for watching, guys. Don't forget to subscribe. New videos every single day. And I'll see you down the road.